concentrate. Aim. Let go. At first, the bullseye appears tiny. Willard fourth grader Allison Sloan has learned fast. And I mean, as you can see, watching her shoot in particular, and and really all the rest of them, it's very meticulous. It's uh, it's a uh, they have a routine. This is Allison's first year of archery, yet she's one of a handful of Kentucky elementary students who place high enough in nationals to move on to the world competition this summer. It just sounds really amazing. I really just want to shoot with someone from another country. She's at practice in a gym, but her talents may have come from the woods. My grandfather takes me hunting, so I learn where the kill zones are, and that really helps me with the 3D model, so that way you know where to aim. When I try, I know where to aim too. I'm so bad. <laughs> you didn't pull it back. Just not how to hit the bullseye. As for Allison, she's off to the Worlds in Nashville. To me, it's just a sport that if you stick with it, you can do amazing, and it's just really what I love. The ambition to aim high, or in Allison Sloan's case, right on target. In Perry County, Jamie McCracken, WYMT Mountain Sports. Now several coverage area archers performed well at nationals. Fifth graders Abby Howard of Letcher County and Taylor Sloan of Pulaski County ranked in the top 10 of nearly 1600 elementary aged girls. Sixth grader Noah Stevens finished third among middle school boys, a group of more than 2600 and several high schoolers also doing well, including Corbin's Blake Botner, who ranked 18th among nearly 2000 high school boys.